I'm just outside Tetbury, a town in the middle of England. The wreath is suggested to date back to ancient Europe where Romans used them to celebrate victory. I put my hat on for this. <laughs> she hasn't got a voice, but she, she has got good form. Narrative perspective also has a huge effect on how readers experience a story. Hey everyone, it's Izzy and Jake here from the Entertainer Squad. Hello, welcome to day three of Love Fashion Live here at the Brunel in Swindon. We've had a really great weekend, lots of stuff has been going on. When writing, it's important to use the correct form of a verb. A verb is the active word in the sentence, the doing word. Today, Caroline and her family enjoy being tour guides and showing visitors around their family home. Because the building looks the same as it did hundreds of years ago, it's a very popular place for filming historical television programmes and films. Cut. But before that, let's get the latest headlines from across Christmas. <laughs> so. I've lost my voice. We've been having so much fun. Oh, on all the rides. Can you hear? I love that nice. I'm <laughs> Crazy shirts. So look at that. Look at that on you. Do you think it suits me? No, that's, that's a good look. If I can pull it off, anyone can, really. Now, thank you today to Belinda for this photo she took of Gotts Park. So, if you want to see your picture here in the forecast, then send them to weather at maidenleads.tv. And what I want to hear is Rachel's top three reindeer facts that people may not know at home. So, so the top facts? Uh, the top fact is definitely the antlers. There we go, that's a, that's a snowman. I think that's quite good. And today, we're going to be taking a look at some super cute new products from LOL Surprise. So we've got the Water Surprise Game, the Puzzle Surprise, and the Cute Rebel Activities book as well. Cheers. Yeah. 